out of your house, you turn to the right, and then right again. You walk straight, 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 until you reach the coast, and then you turn left. You continue walking straight along the coast, the seas on your right hand side, until you reach New Haven. You take a ferry, and you cross the channel. You cross the border into France when you arrive into Dieppe. In Grenoble, you cross the border again into Italy, into Torino. You take a ferry again, and you cross the Mediterranean. You're now crossing the border into Tunisia. The coast is now on your left side. Until you reach the border with Libya, you walk, and you walk, and you walk, until you reach the border with Egypt. You cross the border into Egypt, until you reach Nueva, the border with Israel. You cross the border into Elat. This should have taken you 39 days and 18 hours. You open the door. It's the house where you were born. They say it was very happy here before I was born. Day 
If someone was to ask me where I come from, I would say from my mother's womb. As for the place where I was born, I didn't have much choice. What's your date of birth? How old are you? Do you have children? Where is your mother from? Where do you come from? How many languages do you speak? Are you married? Where is your husband? Are you together? Are you separated? Do you live together? What's his profession? What's his national insurance number? Do you have family? Is your family here? Where is your family? What's your favorite fruit? Where do you live? What's your address? Do you live on your own? What's in your fridge? Did you pack on your own? Did someone give you any package to bring with you? What's your occupation? sitting opposite me, I realized that every man has the same value as every other. I discovered with a shock, as a result of the gaze that battered against mine, a kind of universal identity of all man. His gaze was not someone else's. It was my own that I was meeting in a mirror, inadvertently and in a state of solitude and self-oblivion. It could have been stated more clearly, though I will be deflowering it somewhat in the following aphoristic way. Only one man exists and has ever existed in the world. 
he is in his entirety in each of us. Therefore, he is our self. Each is the other and the others. Jean Genet.